Hi everybody, this is Ben coming to you with your tip of the week. In this week's tip, I'm coming to you from my family's golf course, Lincoln Hills Golf Club in Upper Sandusky, Ohio. Lincoln Hills was built in 1927 on roughly 80 rolling acres in Upper Sandusky, Ohio. My great-grandfather was one of the original investors and our family became sole owners in the 1930s. The course is celebrating its 95th anniversary this year and is still operating its nine beautiful holes, practice range, and four hole short course. In this tip, we're going to talk about how to hit shots off of various slopes. And here at Lincoln Hills, we have lots of varying lies that we can work with. But before we get started with that, I'd like to put to rest one thing. Yes, I do have ankles. So in this situation right here, we're standing on a down slope. And typically when we're on a down slope, we will see the ball want to curve to the right. So we are going to account for that by aiming to the left. The other thing we want to pay attention to is that it's much more difficult to hit a ball solid on a down slope. We do not want to come into the golf ball and hit the ground first behind the ball. So we're going to put the ball towards the back of our stance, ensuring that we will hit down on it. When that happens, we're also going to hit the ball lower. So we need to account for that when the ball is landing on the green. So here's another situation where we have a ball on an uneven slope. And in this case, it's an upslope. Upslopes will typically make the ball want to curve to the left. So we will account for that by aiming slightly to the right. We're also going to put the ball right in the middle of the stance. We don't want it towards the front because that will promote even more right to left curve. Once we're in the middle of the stance, we're going to put that club down and we're going to make sure that we turn as much as possible through the shot to avoid a ball that curves way to the left. In this situation right here, we have a ball sitting on a down slope below our feet. So we're going to do the same thing we did on the down slope shot and aim to the left. This will make the ball want to go to the right. We're also going to widen our stance slightly. When we widen our stance, we move our head down, which gets us closer to the golf ball. So instead of standing with a narrower stance and bending way over at the waist, we're going to stand with a wider stance with the same posture we normally would so that we can still get down to the golf ball. So here I have the ball above my feet, and for a right-handed player, that will typically mean that the ball is going to go to the left. So the first thing I would do is aim slightly to the right and expect that movement on the golf ball. Secondly, I'm going to choke up on the golf club, just maybe an inch or two. And that will allow the club itself to sit a little more level to the horizon. My ball is still going to be in the middle of my feet, and from there I make a nice turn through the ball. And sometimes, when you're in a real tricky spot, you just have to improvise. So I hope that helps you navigate the slopes the next time you're on the golf course. Well, time to roll.